will talk about the number system conversion initially we should know what is a number system what is the necessity for the number system and and what does this really the conversion means okay so we human beings we are using the decimal number system in our day to day life for any conversion mathematical calculations counting and everything so our number system is the decimal system okay so this is the decimal system where we have 10 numbers from 0 to 9 okay in the case of uh, machine system we have basically three number systems they are binary numbers so in binary numbers as the name implies there are only two numbers which is 0 and 1 when you go for this next one is this octal number where there are eight numbers ranging from 0 to 7 okay and then the next number is the hexa decimal number where there are 16 numbers okay which is from 0 to 9 and then we have a b c d e and f which implies a stands for 10 b stands for 11 c for 12 d for 13 E for fourteen and F for fifteen. Okay, so now it is necessary to convert our number system to the decimal uh, to the machine number system. So how this conversion can take place? First of all, we will see about uh, uh, how to convert a decimal number into a binary number. So we'll take an example of 45 45 is the number and it is since it is decimal the base is 10 now our problem is to convert this particular number into particular number into the binary number that is 1 and then you have to convert into the octal number and then we have to convert into the hexadecimal number we will see one by one how the conversion takes place from one system to the other system okay now we see the example of this number 45 and how this conversion is going to take place using this method which is called as an double double method so what you have to do divide the number into uh, by 2 and write the remainder so i have taken the example as 45 divide by 2 so 2 twos are 4 and then 2 twos are 4 remainder is 1 continue this division again and then 2 ones are 2 2 one is 2 remainder is 0 and then continue 2 fives are 10 remainder is 1 and then 2 2 are 4 remainder is 1 and then 2 1 is 2 remainder is 0 and this cannot be further divided so we have to stop the conversion and now what we have to do is collect the numbers from down to upwards okay and then write the number so what is the answer we have got from this con uh, conversion is 1 0 1 one, 1 0 1 here the base is 2 so the answer is 1 0 1 1 0 1 to the base 2 now we will find the conversion of the same number 45 into an octal number 
okay so how this octal number conversion takes place as we have divided for by 2 for the number binary conversion because it is true now I am uh, for this octal conversion which is the base 8 so what is the uh, uh, procedure is divide the number by 8 as we did here by divided by 2 okay divide the number by 8 and then write the remainder as we did for this uh, binary number okay so now 8 from 8 5 are 40 and then the remainder is 5 now here after this division is not possible you have to stop here so what you have to do again as we did for the binary number just you have to collect the numbers from downwards to upwards now what is the number 5 5 to the base 8 so 5 5 8 is the octal number for the given decimal number 45 now we will see how to make this same conversion of 45 to an hexa number so as we have did here for binary we have divided by 2 for octal we divide by 8 so we have to divide here by 16 okay so now 16 16 twos are 32 okay after 16 twos are 32 the remainder is 13 after this division is not possible so we have to stop the division here so as we did again you have to collect the uh, numbers from downwards to upwards so what is the number 2 and 13 but this 13 is not the number available in our decimal number because I have mentioned here the numbers are 0 and 1 for binary and here the values for 0 to 7 and here the values are 0 to 9 and then 10 is A, 11 is B, for 12 it is C, for 13 it is D, for 14 it is E and for 15 it is F. So totally 0 to 15 is 16 numbers are there in the hexa number. Now what you have arrived is 2 and then 13. We cannot write this uh, 2 and then 13. This is wrong. So how to do this? We have to write 2 as it is 2 because 2 is there in our um, hexa number. Okay. But 13 is the not there in the hexa number. So here this, so this is for A is 10 b 11 okay for c 12 and d is 13 e is 14 and f is 15 okay so now instead of this uh, 13 we have got we have to now substitute this value d so instead of writing this value as 213 what we have to write as the number is 2d which is to the base 16 so for 45 this is the binary number okay so this is the binary value for the 45 this is the octal value for 55 and this is the hexadecimal value for 45 so this is how the conversion takes place from the decimal number to the binary octal and hexadecimal in the next video series we will uh, uh, try to uh, convert the machine number system which is octal hexa and binary to the decimal system okay thank you